so what's going on guys, Games and today, this is going to be my day trip rant of me going to Drayton Manor, yes, and before I start this video, I just want to say that I'm very sorry for not uploading a shout out Sunday on Sunday, obviously, and there will be a legendary shout out Sunday with two people in it, yeah, two people in it coming out this week, so stay tuned, sorry for the person who didn't get a shout out yeah, on Sunday, you will get one this Sunday, so stay tuned for that. Also, I just want to say that good news, but there might be some good news and bad news coming out uh, pretty much next week, so stay tuned for that as well. But without further ado, let's get over onto my rant. So guys, to kick it off, we were in a bus. Here's some footage. Yes guys, we saw the dead bus trip. And um, after we got on that bus, we saw some more motorways, yeah. At, um, after half an hour, we actually reached a park, and basically we were, we were told to step on a field, which had shit everywhere, and made our shoes dirty, and made us stink for the rest of the day. I mean, what the fuck, and in front of the bloody sun, I mean, school, you are retarded, like, you're trying to kill the kids, yeah, okay. Like, we all had jumpers on, thinking it was cold, but no, it was fucking boiling as shit. Yeah, so, after we enter the park, we got tickets, obviously, because they ain't gonna let us through, because we're little kids, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know what the rules are, yeah. But, after we got our tickets, we were told to go to the centre point, where the pirate shit was. Well, we already knew that anyway. But, after we went, after we went past the centre point, they let us go anywhere we want. So, so what we did was, we went to G4 straight away, ran there, and pretty much we just saved what, what, two hours worth of queue. We got there in half an hour. So we had legends, yeah. We got there in half an hour, bang, shoot on it, get off. And pretty much me and my mate shat our stuff. Like, we were at the front. And when he went up the loop, oh my, the sun legit blinded us. And then after we went on that ride, we went to Shockwave. Yes, guys. So after we went on Shockwave, well, no, after we lined up for Shockwave, it was like, how long? So it was meant to be a 15 minute queue, but for some reason the people working there let too many people on. So we were stood in the sun for what? Like half an hour getting burnt to death. I mean, imagine that guys. You stand in front of the sun and you're told it's gonna be 15 minute wait. And then it was turned into half an hour and you just got some you know, just got red skin everywhere. I mean that ain't, that ain't good guys, that's not good. Yeah, so, as soon as we actually were allowed to go on the ride, so, as soon as we go through, the only good thing was, it was all empty in there. So, you just literally ran up the stairs, you had, like, a couple of people going in front, but I was like, fuck that, I ain't going in front. We just going right, and going anywhere we want. But we still got in the front seat, and, my God, we shut ourselves, like, the sun, again, was in our face, burning me, uh, and that was fucking annoying, again. So, as soon as Shockwave finished, we wanted to Millstorm, and I hated that so much. We thought the queue was very short, but I didn't know the queue stretch out like bloody a mile long. I mean, legit, a mile long. And I, I almost killed myself, like, the sun again almost burnt me to alive. I mean, if I didn't go into shade yet, and I just stood there, I would have been like, I don't know what. I don't know what I would have been. I would have, I would have set a light. Like, trust me, I would have been on fire. So, as soon as we actually got to near the start of the ride, so actually where the ride, actually, we're actually on the ride, some little faggot midgets come in front of us and push in. I mean, the bloody person who was operating the machine saw them pushing in and it's all like, I'm on. I mean, dude, you're not doing your job properly. I mean, fuck off, mate. We, we waited two hours, yeah, and you let these little cunts come in, wait 15 minutes. I mean... What a dickhead are you? Yeah, so that's annoying our Mailstorm, but that was it. That's, that, that was pretty much why I was annoyed on Mailstorm. So, so we went to go get registered because our school wanted to get registered. Yeah, at like midday. So as soon as we get registered, we want to go eat because I, well, I didn't have breakfast because I'm a savage. Yeah. So we had so we had, we had, we had we went to go get breakfast. And as soon as that, we went to the toilets, yeah, next to the zoo. And then we thought, wait, why don't we go to Apocalypse? 
So we went to Apocalypse the first time, and the, we waited there. We waited in the queue for about 15 minutes. We didn't move a single inch. So we're like, fuck this, come back later. So then we went to the, what is it, Drunken Barrels? And that made me feel sick, man. Like, I don't know what I did, man. That was horrible. Even though there's a queue there as well, when it's like, what? Bloody 15 Drunken Barrels there. And there's a bunch of little midgets as well. I mean, bloody hell, Dretton Mana. So, after that Drunken Barrels, we were like, you know what? I want to go to Apocalypse again. And guess what? We were in there again. Waited five minutes. We didn't move an inch again. So, we like, fuck that. We thought, wait, why not go G Force? Or Ben 10? Or A. What is it? Alienate? I don't know. Oh, fuck that. I don't know what her name is. But Ben 10, yeah. Uh. G Force Shockwave. We thought, yeah, why not? Them rides must be empty. But no. It was stupid. Like, I mean. Oh. We went to Ben 10. The the ride the queue was massive the whole day. I mean at four o'clock, the ride was empty, and that was but that was when we had to go. I mean, why do this, man? So we went to G Force, and the queue wasn't as big, but it was like 15 minute wait. I'm like, can't be asked for that. We went to Shockwave, it was double the size of G Force. Like, the queue was double the size of G Force. I mean, nope, fuck that. So after that, we went to. Dodge rooms and guess what? There was a queue there as well. Yay! That's what I hated as well. So you know what? I was like, you know what? I want to get a teddy bear. Cause I'm, I'm a teddy bear fan, yeah. So I spent four quan, four pound trying to win a teddy bear. Not even a single win. I mean, drain money, you just ripped me off. So for the like, for for the third time in this video, we went to Apocalypse again. We waited about what, 20 minutes in there. And then, you know, I was like, fuck this, I'm not coming back again. We just went, and pretty much we had like, what, 45 minutes. Check G-Force, that one's too big, again. Shockwave, again, big. So it was like, you know what, I want to win another teddy bear. I failed. Bad. So, I went to the pirate ship, and that was the only ride that had a less queue. And I was actually happy until we had to leave. The park, which was depressing. Even then, we had to stand in really soon because people didn't turn up on time. Why well, didn't people? Congratulations. Yeah, because of them little idiots, we had to wait 10 minutes longer. But as soon as we finally got on the coach, this is what I saw on the coach. Alright, so guys, so I was gonna say, I hope you like this video. If you want me to see, if you want more rants of me, or just pretty much some random bullshit that's cool more PM on the spot. Remember to leave a like on this video, subscribe if you're new, and comment if you like me or not. Nah, no, joke, don't do that yet. I feel I feel a bit too emotional saying people like me when they when they don't. I mean, yeah. But anyway, thank you guys for watching. Please smash the like button and subscribe. Game thing over and out.